All right, just gonna do a video showing that the Christ, the false Christ, I should say, of the ESV perversion of the Bible is in fact Lucifer. So let's go to the Word of God, first the King James Bible. Okay, first of all, in the KJV, Lucifer is referred to as the quote unquote son of the morning in Isaiah chapter 14, verse 12. Here's what it says. How art thou fallen from heaven, O Lucifer, son of the morning? How art thou cut down to the ground which did weaken the nations? Okay, some points I want to make on that. So Lucifer is called the son of the morning, okay? Uh, and Jesus Christ, on the other hand, is referred to as the morning star or day star or just star, okay? Big difference there, okay? Second Peter chapter 1, verse 19 in the KJV, which is the word of God in English. Second Peter chapter 1, verse 19. We have also a more sure word of prophecy, wherein, whereunto ye do well, that ye take heed as unto a light that shineth in a dark place, until the day dawn and the day star arise in your heart. Uh, what else is there? Revelation chapter 22, verse 16. Uh, is in the, again, the KJV. I, Jesus, have sent my angel to testify unto you these things in the churches. I am the root of the, and the offspring of David and the bright and morning star. Okay, again, we see the thing of a star there. Uh, Revelation chapter 2, verses 28 in the KJV, of course. Revelation chapter 2, verses 28. And it's again Jesus speaking, and I will give him the morning star. Also, one other scripture on the matter. Sorry, I just had a bit of a camera problem there. Another scripture on the matter, uh, Numbers chapter 24, verse 17. It says, I shall see him, but not now. I shall behold him, but not nigh. There shall come a star out of Jacob, and a scepter shall rise out of Israel, and shall smite the corners of Moab, and destroy all the children of Sheth. Okay, a star, not son of the morning. Okay, big difference there. Now, notice how the ESV twists this and actually gives Lucifer the same title as Jesus. Watch this. This is Isaiah chapter 14, verse 12 in the ESV this time, the perversion uh, of God's word. Numbers chapter, sorry, Isaiah chapter 14, verse 12. I do apologize. But uh, Isaiah chapter 14, verse 12. This is in the ESV. How are how you are fallen from heaven, O day star, son of dawn? How are you cut down to the ground who laid the nations low? Notice how they remove the word Lucifer and just give him, O day star, son of, son of dawn. They're giving Lucifer a title of Jesus, but not just the KJV title for Jesus, you know, the, the day star. But notice how even in the ESV, they use the exact same term morning star, or they call him the star to refer to Jesus Christ. So they're giving him the same title as Lucifer. Why? Well, because the Christ of the ESV is in fact Lucifer. This is Revelation chapter 22, verse 16 in the ESV. Uh, they call it the English Standard Version, but I call it the ESV. I say it stands for Extremely Satanic Version. But, And this is why right here. This is Revelation 22, verse 16. I, Jesus, have sent my angel to testify to you about these things for the churches. I am the root and the descendant of David, the bright and morning, the bright morning star. But wait a second, isn't that what Lucifer was called? You know, what was he called in the ESV? O day star, son of dawn. So Christ is giving himself the title of Lucifer. You know, the Christ of the ESV, basically. Second uh, Peter chapter 1, verse 19, again in the ESV the extremely satanic version. He says, and we have the prophetic word more fully confirmed to which you will do well to pay attention as to a lamp shining in a dark place until the day dawns and the morning star rises in your hearts. So you got a bit of a problem there. So not only is the, the ESV giving Christ the title of Lucifer of how Lucifer is described in the KGB, but even the ESV, they're giving him the same title, you know? Why? Because again, the Christ of the ESV is Lucifer. You know, and this is another thing these modern versions often attack not only the deity of Christ, but even the name of Christ too, and even the character of Christ. That's why I say, again, the ESV stands for extremely satanic version, because that's all that it is. It's just a Vatican perversion of God's word. So don't be deceived. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Goodbye. Thank you.